Science, science, science. I like science. Alright, Martin, focus. I'm problem. I'm feeding twice the chickens that I need to be, incubating twice the eggs I need to be, not making any money. How do I fix this? Good point, since we euthanize all male chicks as they're not needed in egg production. I went to a symposium a few weeks ago where we were discussing sexing bull semen. I wonder if we can do something like that with chickens. Hold on, Dr. Z. I foresee some problems. Currently in mammals, there are two ways to sort sperm cells by sex. The first method is to permeabilize the sperm cell membrane and then expose these cells to a dye. This dye attaches to the Y chromosome of male sperm. These sperm cells are then passed under a laser. The laser causes the Y chromosome containing sperm to glow differently than the sperm which contain an X chromosome. The glowing sperm cells are then put through the semen sorting machine in a single file line. In the machine, they are mechanically sorted into pools of X and Y chromosomes. The other method of sorting sperm cells by sex is to expose the sperm cells to a toxin. This toxin targets the Y chromosome, causing Y chromosome containing sperm to... Unfortunately, the problem with trying to sex chicken semen lies with the fact that chicken gender is determined by the egg cell. In mammals, gender is determined using an XY system. If a Y chromosome containing sperm fertilizes an egg, then an XY, or male offspring, is produced. If an X chromosome containing sperm fertilizes an egg, then an XX, or female, offspring is produced. In chickens, gender determination works the opposite way. It is controlled by the egg cell, not the sperm. If a sperm cell fertilizes a Z containing egg cell, the resulting offspring is ZZ, or male. If a sperm cell fertilizes a W containing egg cell, the resulting offspring is ZW, or female. We don't sex chicken semen because all the sperm cells are Z chromosome containing. It's too bad we don't do it, because the energy savings of incubating half of the eggs in Canada would be $52 million, or enough to power Leduc, Lacombe, and Camrose for one year. It's too bad that when it comes to gender determination in chickens, it's hens that rule the roost. Oh, they're jacket this week. Mm -hmm.